almost like a Mongolian feel there. I immediately thought of Kiev, Morocco. With a bit of gypsy. Gypsy, that's what it was. It was totally gypsy. It's always gratifying when a promising young talent delivers on that promise. That's what Joseph Al-Jazeera did tonight with a collection that was evocative, opulent, and actually quite fantastic. You know, it kind of started with the idea of someone who would have started out with a wardrobe that was very French and very strict. And along the way, they'd pick up, you know, something from Morocco and something from India and something from China. And it was kind of like this hodgepodge of, of references. And it was really about thinking about the idea of chic and the idea of style. I don't usually like journey collections because I feel like they're too literal and too costumey. But it wasn't too literal, or maybe it, even if it was literal, it was so well done that it didn't matter to me. <laughs> I thought it was a really beautiful collection. I thought the women looked amazing. I love like those the thigh high leather boots. I think it's really flattering. I loved all all the the texture with the pattern. And I don't think you see that very often. And I think it is about doing something that's very, very different and identifiable. The coats, the outerwear, I think are the, the knockouts. We did a lot of work on how things were tailored and how things were cut this season. In the past, we've really taken it apart and put it back together. This time, it was really thinking about how you classically make a jacket and how we could make it ours and better. There was a very good narrative in that collection. It was tightly edited and, and extremely well styled. And I liked the sound effects also, the little tinkling of the coins. It was an escape in the sense that um, he painted a very vivid picture. On the other hand, I think those clothes were just the kind of clothes that real women that I know would would love to wear, would do anything to wear. I mean, the, the great flared pants, the velvet jackets, the fur pea coats. I mean, I could go on and on. I think that, I think it was a, a really, really big moment for him. <laughs>